Do you think they're Gucci glasses? Let's find out. Prada, that's a very expensive brand. Empty bag. Snare, snare. I'm trying to get my, my uh, talking voice right. <laughs> snare. Scott, what do you do when you start your video? Um, turn it sideways. Oh, I just thought like, I got some like, practice for your, your voice. <laughs> anyway, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome to another unboxing with the storage auction pirate. That is he, he is I. I am him. I think I said that right. Anyway, we're going to go through some of these boxes here. I'm going to pick a stack. They're all right here, and we're gonna unbox boxings for yet another great unboxing out of these three pods I bought. And uh, don't forget to, um, before we get started, like this video like this with a big thumbs up, and then share this video. Do it however you need to. Next time you're at the laundromat, you see somebody next to you, and they're uh, folding their clothes and they're drying, you wanna make small talk, say, hey, I saw the guy on uh, YouTube, Storage Auction Pirate. You must check out his channel. He is the coolest dude with his little pink mohawk. Anyway, that'd be great. Let us get started on uh, unpacking these boxes and uh, don't forget to subscribe to Scott's channel here. This is uh, Storage Scott. He is right now editing a video. He is here learning how to edit a video that is for a safe, a safe he found full of gold. You're going to want to go to his channel and be ready to watch this video. He already has some up of it. I'm even in, I think, one of his videos. Yeah, I also have a guest appearance. I did a collab with him. So don't forget to sub I'll put the link right here. Wanna, wanna, uh, what's your name again, Scott? No, you can't hear Sorry, I was editing my cuss words. I gotta watch my cuss words in the future. Look at that. <laughs> I'm learning. I te believe it or not, people, I teach people not to cuss. That's amazing, <laughs> huh? The it's irony. It's so easier to not cuss as opposed to editing it out. Yeah. Tell me about it. I've learned. I've grown so much with this channel. Anyway, let's get back to work. Believe it or not, ladies and gentlemen, it says we have a shoes box. I thought we covered all the shoes. I thought we had covered all the shoes. I was so wrong. What do we got in here? Looks like a, hold on a second here. That's not a shoe, that's probably envelopes, exactly what it says. We got some e-spirits, nothing, nothing too hot in the streets there. I'm over shoes right now. You watched my vlog the other day where I went out with the shoes, it was annoying to try to sell them on a Sunday. Wasn't impressed. Anklines, those pointy shoes. Pointy is the top in the streets, I think, right now. Everybody's doing that. Guess. Guess what's in here. Guess shoes. I'm so thrilled with guess shoes. Hear, the, hear it in my voice. You can see it. What do we got here? Nordstrom's. Let's get our knife. We always have our knife handy. <laughs> Nothing. Earn extra money. They were doing telemarketing, pyramid scheme. All right. Alfani, blah, 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 blah. Those are kind of cute, though. If you could see the bottom of the shoe, that would be like, that's so cute. And then you look at the side, and it's like, that's not that cute. A gray box. What is in here? Ooh. Prada. Can those be good shoes? We're going to have to hold off on those. We will have to hold off on those because those are possibly good. Big difference between. These are a good brand too. Please be something hot in here. Those are nice. Those are pretty dope. The coast. The cost. The, co the coosty. So we'll put those in the good pile. I'm breaking stuff. Those are not that cute. Yeah, yeah. No. Comment below if you think these are cute. Let's hear your advice. I've been saying everything that's cute. I need you guys to tell me if this is cute right here. Those are size seven and a half. This right here has Pyrex set cookware rice cooking. Is that what's in here? Yes, sadly it is. Rice cooker. I don't see any Cutco dishes or knives. I'm always looking for Cutco. We got a beautiful tea set. Anybody need a tea set? And uh, it looks like just your basic kitchen item. See? Kitchen item looks like a lid, Pyrex lid. Not a pirate lid, a Pyrex. Stuff like that. Okay. We're done with this box. Whoo. What do we got here? Antique wine bottles. Now, 
I don't want to just film some wine bottles. Kind of boring. But it says antique wine bottles. So now we have to see what kind of wine bottles we have. Are these priceless wine bottles? Could that be? Ooh, look, we got a clock. That'd be a grandfather clock for baby Jeebus. Got you, baby Jeebus. Yep, that's a liquor bottle. That is a liquor bottle. Okay, this is a boring box. They're empty, so that right off the bat, that makes them not very valuable. Ooh, man in the mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the fairest of them all? You. Okay, that's pretty much a booze box. That was not fun. Here we have some. Ooh, Coral, I don't know what that means, Coral Garage and Albums. Heavy box, like that's heavy to me. Kind of annoys me, these heavy boxes. And that's what Coral means. Ooh, it's an American flag. That is a big, what the? I gotta get bugged the way people pack stuff. I get extremely bugged the way people pack stuff. It's a, it's a prime example of things that bug me when people pack. This is a nice American flag. This is a good one. I like it. I just like the vintageness of it, the, the patina, the type of material. Nice. Let's fold this back up. Now, something that I've learned recently is coral is worth a little bit of money. I want to try to be careful with that because coral has some weird value. Please be another Ozzy Osbourne concert t-shirt. Nope, it's the Giants. Boo. Go A's. Look at this piece of coral. I wish I had a salt fish tank, a sea salt, salt fish tank type thing because that would look pretty in there. Get some little Finding Nemo fishes swimming around up in there. This piece of coral right here. This is nice. Look at that. Wow. That has to be worth money. I don't know what. I just know that that is a big piece of coral. And I know I've sold some recently, like half this size for 20, 30 bucks, a piece of the flea market. That is a nice find right there. Look at this piece of coral. Now I know why they put, oh wow, we gotta be careful. That's a piece of coral too. That is a tree. That is a sea tree right there. Look at that. That is so cool. It's a sea tree. Don't break it, Michael. Let's see if we can come around here, angle our hands right, and let's show it better. There we go. That looks like a sea tree to me. I don't know. Could I be wrong? What is that? That is nice. It's got roots. I'm extremely intrigued by these things. Now look at this one. I like this one. That's crazy. I bet that's worth some money right there. I need to find out. I know, I, I, I'm telling you, I, read, I don't know where I read it, but coral was worth money. And I sold some recently because of that. I did some research and people were like, coral's making a comeback. Let's remove these. Those are nothing. Those are. Cool. Another piece of coral. Wow. All the broken pieces from it getting squished in there. Losing compromised or making it compromised integrity. Ooh, we got a gun cleaning kit. Could this be the gun cleaning kit they used with the guns I found? If you have not seen the video where I found guns recently that I'm gonna to take to the FFL, check it out. It was on my YouTube a couple videos ago. Cleaning stuff. Now, oh, I totally forgot my sea tree was right there. I'm so upset. Dang. Sega Genesis? What are those? High frequency. These must be aftermarket Sega Genesis controllers. Must be. That's a Sega Genesis. See? 
Yeah, these are aftermarket because they come with the extra turbo buttons. And then this one's the aftermarket without turbo buttons. Still cool. That's the eBay stuff. We'll put that in our eBay pile. We love video games. And then they got records. ACDC Men in Black. I'd put that on eBay if it was a little better shape. Please. Judas Priest. ACDC. Black Sabbath. That's a dollar or two right there. Ozzy Osbourne. Who is just the cover? Quiet Riot. That looks like a cool cover, but doesn't sell very well. That one might be a good one. City Life. Elvis. ACDC. ACDC. Led Zeppelin. Empty. Nope, there's a good one in there. So that's probably a $20 record. It's in good shape. Mm, nope, VG. The Police. Good band. Cheap record. Champagne Jam. Don't know of them. California Jam. We got more Police. You must really like that record. Come on, be a diamond in the rough. All the potential. That's another good one right there. It's the second album. It's a four, I think it's a two album set. Steve Miller Band. YT. We're not gonna get too lucky here. Running out of time here to get a good record. Black Sabbath, five, 10 bucks. Aerosmith, five, 10 bucks. Ozzy Osbourne, no record again. Huey Lewis in the news, almost sealed. Scorpions. Now we have stuff labeled Xbox, miscellaneous stuff, and that's not looking like Xbox. Pad de bag, patty bag, world publication. <coughs> Excuse my cough. Oh, what is this? Something that's kind of boring. Central Park. Ooh, it's his and hers matching jackets, no? No, they're not matching. Now, please put at least something Xbox since you said it was Xbox. There is partial Rainbow Six headset, no game. Well, that's a good sign. Golden Vulture, I used to date one of those. Ooh, it's birdies. Vintage classic badminton birdies. No, I, I'm never going to get those back in there. Are we going to try? We're going to do everything backwards the hard way. That's how we do things. Around here. Okay. Now that we got that. This looks like nothing but personal stuff. And we got an Xbox One. Xbox Ones and a, a black bag. Dining out, okay. Xbox One, uh, I'm not sure what that's worth. We'll put them, I got all my video game stuff aside for my video game guy. Scott, what are you doing over here? We are making Are you a editing safe a safe video? video. It's a video, coming Ooh. out. What'd you find in that unit? A ton of gold, you gotta watch, you gotta find out. Ooh, he's learning quick how you do it. He said you have to go to his channel. Once again, I'll put his link down below. Storage Scott, you have to go to his channel to see how much gold he found in this unit and that safe. I promise uh, this this safe will not be um, a bust like a lot of safes you see me open. No pun intended, a bust, get it? Ha -ha. Check it out. Here we, are. we have bags. What? Never had my phone guy before. Never ever? No. Probably good, it needs to be shut down. Mickey Mouse, looks like children's clothes. Children's polos, children's... Disney, Mickey. It's a good box of children's clothes. Anybody out there as a child? I don't know. Hmm. We won't go any further than that. All right, we got Xbox games. That's what it says. And of course, there's more freaking shoes. Imagine that. What do we have here? These shoes come with some type of warranty or something. Very simple, very boring. High heels. Not impressed with those. Carrying on, we have lots of video games. Ghost Recon, this is all Xbox. Xbox, this one's brand new, never even opened. 007, if this was N64, that's the greatest game ever made right there. Let's see, are they all in here? Yes, look at that, we're making money. Freestyle metal. I don't see so far any. That one's brand new. Any 
extremely good Xbox Rare games. These are just the very common games everybody had. I imagine I'm gonna get five bucks a piece on these, maybe four. Maybe if I eBay them in a lot, maybe I'd probably get like a hundred for all of them one time. Vintage games are hot. These are just before games are really good. You want to get into the cartridges, the ones you had to blow on in the end. We're just going to assume the rest are in here. Look at that. Probably going too quick. Everybody's going to be like, Pirates, slow down. We can't even see this stuff. What's the point of making a video if we can't see what it is? Idiot. Yeah, I said it. Ghost Right Recon. Hitman. So they like shooting games, I could tell. All right. That's it for video games. Oh, there might be more in there. There could be more. Look at that. We saw all those. Well, that's a fun little game. Try to get them all in there. We got more games. NFL Blitz 2003. Sports games are never really good. Jaws Unleashed. Burnout. Mortal Kombat Armageddon. I would imagine that has potential. FIFA Soccer, that was a cool game. You get together with your homies, play some of that. Pac-Man, classic, timeless. Midnight Club. Franco Sardo. What's up with that? Can we even see that? Yes, we can. We've got to double check here. Mm, those are very boring, too. No money in there. Not impressed. Not impressed. Probably a 5 or $10 shoe. Is this Humpty Dumpty? Now, what are these people right here? Look at that. That's a pizza guy. Banana Republic. Is that in there? Okay. Mm, not impressed. Not impressed. It is a Banana Republic if you look inside. So these are probably good. That's not, not my color. Very plain. Very, I don't know. I'm sure you guys can gather what my style would be because I stated a lot. Ooh, Michael Kors. What do we got here? Is it in there? Let's see. Boring. I'm not very enthusiastic with somebody's clothes today. That looks kind of boring to me. This looks very like, uh, what would you call the word for these, Scott? What kind of stuff would you call these? I don't know. Looks like something you see somebody wearing a Burning Man. That's what it looks like. But they're Michael Kors and very sellable. We will put that with our good, and that's crap, shoes. What's that? That's say Craig's Boots Uggs? Hmm. Craig's Uggs. So we got the person's Uggs, and that was a good couple bucks on those two. Bill Blass, I don't know what that is worth. Haven't heard of that, oh, $36. There we go. Could this be an envelope full of money? Nope because it has notes on the front and personal paperwork. What do we always say? Hashtag, don't take a personal. Levi's purse, that's almost cute. I hope this is not what they're calling their Uggs. Like they really wrote down that their Uggs were in there. Look at that. These are beat up. That's like an $8, $5 pair of Uggs. And they took the time to write that on a box that their Uggs were in there. Gucci. Gucci. We will have to save that to the end of the video to open with our box of Prada. Where did that go? It's around here somewhere, waiting for us. Come on, let's hurry along here and get out of these boxes. What do we got here? Oh, some boots by Dingo. Empty bag. Ooh, that got me. That almost scared the crap out of me. Did you guys, did you guys see that? Did you guys see that? That almost scared the crap out of me for a split second I jumped. You guys caught that on camera. Damn, ladies and gentlemen, uh, part of my French. Let me take that back. I'm not gonna say that. Whoo! Look at that thing was right there facing the box. You guys saw it. that was a natural reaction because I was like, oh my, there is a rattlesnake in his box. What? Really? I jumped. Like my eyes were like. <laughs> I'm scared to go in this box, ladies and gentlemen. Another sensey candle, but this one's empty. It feels like. Robert, Robert, Robert the Lion. I bet this was an expensive one. Oh, no. That's Robert the Lion Scentsy doll. Look at that. I'm a lion. Rawr. I'm going to set that aside. We'll have to look that up on eBay. And that's a wrap on this box. All right. So, 
I guess this is the one we all been waiting for. We found these Gucci, right here, Gucci glasses cases. We all know Gucci's very expensive. Gucci glass frames are gonna cost, what, like 200 to $1,000, somewhere in there. Anyway, we wanna see if they're in there, right? Do you wanna see, do you, you hear that? There's something in there. Do you think they're Gucci glasses? Let's find out. Are those Gucci glasses? Case looks legit. Gucci, made in Italy. Prescription glasses, steel frames. I would definitely eBay them, but this is questionable. See how the Gucci logo is not inside of there? Hmm, interesting. Gucci glass cases, that's 10 bucks on eBay though, believe it or not, I get 10 bucks for that. Looks legit, I don't see a Made in China sticker on the inside like you normally would. Huh, I don't know. Now, same here, once again, Prada. That's a very expensive brand. Not the most expensive, but sounds like something's in there. So, let's see. On 62 billion, you guys start counting from one. One 1,000, go like that and count. Okay, psych, let's open it. I know I'm rough with the shoes. Someone's gonna be like, you're rough with the shoes. Those are, what in the? This is what happens in the heat. Your shoes, your stuff sits in the storage forever. And this is what happens. Things peel. We were just talking about that earlier. Cause wasn't Uncle Scott, wasn't Uncle Michael's shoe he said the sole was coming off of? Yeah, it happens in storage units all the time. I think these are legit. The feel of them, you feel that right there, guys? Can you feel that? That feels like legit leather, and so does the bottom. They're not plastic, but they're, 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 but this is the touring. I don't know if that's even worth getting fixed, but, damn it. That would have been a nice pair of shoes. All right, now it's a, my most awkward time of the moment of a video is we're going to make thumbnails. Like here is what we're using for a thumbnail today. It is a rattlesnake because it was in the unit and it almost got me. And like I reached in there, I don't know if you saw that, but if anybody pay attention, I jumped back because I thought it was gonna bite me. It's a real, look at that, real, real legit rattlesnake. See the teeth? What if it got you? This is ridiculous, I know. Let's do without the glasses now. Always gotta have two different frames so we can see what it's like. So you wanna go. <laughs> Ridiculous, huh? Look at my Jeebus face. <laughs> you scared on my own. This is ridiculous, but I thought it'd be a lot more fun if I did this instead of taking photos or to actually just make a video because it's obviously a lot more fun. The hook is earring. <laughs> ridiculous is my middle name. So we're gonna be like. One second like this. Let's go like this, watch. No? You don't know, like that, Scott? Come on. <laughs> Scott thinks I'm ridiculous. He's here. I'm actually doing this with somebody watching. So just so you know. I can't even look at you. Look, Scott, like this. Wow. That's what you do. That's funny. All right. I couldn't resist, but. Really? Yeah, uh, everybody. Hold on a second.